in the near future we're going to have a baby as well yeah we have to keep in mind that we're going to be having children at some mm. point and we need to have a house as well. Welcome to Jin and Hattie. I'm Hattie. I'm Hattie. I'm Jin. This is Jin and welcome to Jin and Hattie. If you can hear any licking sounds, that is Snuffleupolis. As you guys read the comment, no, title and thumbnail, yeah, it is right. After moving two months, we have to move again. We're moving again. Yeah, we're moving again. We just wanted to talk about this with our people. We just Gentis. wanted to give you a life update tell yeah. you where we're at tell you yeah. where we're going to be before we start we just wanted to say a massive thank you to the group for sponsoring today's video we went to go and visit their stall at a stall i'd say like rooms yeah <laughs> so beauty week <laughs> let's so just go and look okay three two one because <laughs> <laughs> we're in the b2b again let's get in let's get in we're gonna show you guys So many beauty brands here. Oh, guys, by the way, we got invited for the Seoul Beauty Week. And B2B. Right after Seoul Fashion Week. Yeah, the B2B. Do you know B2B? I do know B2B. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's so pretty. Week and we've been invited by B2B and we are very excited. We're just gonna go and look around. Okay, so now. We go ahead. Wow. <gasps> Baby, Olivia, Tony Molly. So this is in the Soul Beauty Week. Yeah, this is in Soul Beauty Week. And so there's so many all the different it's like an expo for the future of the beauty for what's coming up. And it's really exciting and you get to test out new products, you get to test out, you know, the best sellers, see what's like going on. Can we try it all? Yes. Let's go. Let's, Let's get all the free stuff. Hello, VT. Back again. <laughs> Here we are. Oh, oh, oh. It's our friend. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 Wow, it's caviar oil, guys. <laughs> oh, you look quite happy today. Is it I'm your habit? I'm very heaven? happy. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, Nail polish. Thank you. Wow. These are so much fun. Like, there's so many like games and stuff that you can do. <laughs> they're just like they're the most fun things ever. Oh my god. Oh. I'm gonna take it all. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Ooh. I'm here in Olinyang. Wow. Basically in Europe. <laughs> you love this one? Oh yeah, isn't it? So many brands we collab with I know. here. <laughs> now I can see your eyes are. It's the same that I go to the football store. Yeah. So we just got to be the bee, and we're gonna have a look around in that exhibition. We have the biggest one. And this is the beauty lounge. Let's try it all. Yeah. Oh my god, you can't even test your face. Oh my god, I don't know. <laughs> is it checking your age? Mm. <gasps> you look 24 years old. Oh my god. god. Stop. <laughs> really? It's the Bosox. Yeah, he's doing the business. Ooh. Oh. I'm 25 years old. Oh my god. Wrinkles? Normal. Skin condition? Normal. Hey, Ginny? You look 30. You look 30. <laughs> okay. What you mean? Laughing? Wow, it's in Japan. Oh my god, what's this? Yeah, and a tropical rainforest. <laughs> the bee, the bee. I feel like I'm in the future. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! Okay. Okay. Have you guys enjoyed? Did you enjoy that? <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. We had a great Ooh. time. Yeah, we went back to our conversation. So, yeah, why are we moving? Okay. So. <sighs> He was like, no, because she loves the balcony. So, so uh, first of all, we moved to apartment. We're living in Billa, but we're moving to apartment again. Why? Um, Because... How many reasons are there? I can give a few reasons. But okay. my main reason for me personally is that I've really struggled to settle into this house. And it has not been easy for me in the way that moving previously has been. 
I found it really hard to feel at home here. Um, it's a beautiful house. It's a wonderful house and it's going to make a wonderful home for somebody else, just not for us, which is really sad because we put a lot of effort and time into this house, but we're going to bring all of that and put it into our new apartment, which will hopefully, fingers crossed, be the home for yeah, us everything, forever. <laughs> everything, furniture and everything will move in. But what we're thinking is that um, moving to the apartment would be the better choice since we also not thinking about right now but also in the near future we're gonna have a baby as well yeah we have to keep in mind that we're gonna be having children at some mm. point and we need to have a house that's going to be child friendly and from simply raising a dog in the house that we're in now we have come to realize that the stairs are maybe not it for children or dogs <laughs> yeah <laughs> so yeah. we tried um snowy can go up the stairs snowy can't come down the stairs uh, therefore snowy is he he gets freaked out and then he goes to the toilet therefore snowy is not allowed up the stairs which cut which cuts off a massive part of the house for him yeah. so he's only allowed to be in the downstairs area which then makes me feel guilty because my office is upstairs when mm. i go to work upstairs i have to leave him down here and i have to pick basically between doing my work or leaving my dog on his own downstairs um, which yeah. doesn't sound like a big deal, but I'm up there for like long periods of time doing subtitles So it feels kind of unfair to separate myself from him. He is also my therapy dog as well I do need to state that so <laughs> and I, I kind of knew that um, Apartment would be the better choice But Hattie's the kind of person who needs to try first and see if it fits her and then she does Jin's mom. My parents, basically. Jin's mom was like, number one, a villa. Uh, you need to move into an apartment. You shouldn't move into a villa. Number two, you're never going to go upstairs. And I was like, Omni, trust me. I'm going to go upstairs. We have stairs in Western houses. I'm going to go upstairs all the time. Since I realized that Snowy is not able to come down the stairs, I have barely been upstairs because I feel too mean to leave him down here on his own whilst I go and chill up with Cleo. I just feel that for our family now it's really sad on it's really sad for i'm really ecstatic to be moving because i have found that since i've moved into this house i can't explain it but my mental health has really dropped and i don't know why and i try to rearrange the furniture i've tried to change some things i've tried to work on myself <laughs> like um but nothing is really fixing this this feeling of like pure exhaustion that I get when I enter the house and I can't explain it and it sounds really dramatic but mentally I just my brain does not fit into this house um I can add the proper commentary for that that's not dramatic and number one you're living in the foreign country for you which is not your home country so house is the safest place you stay and you should feel most comfortable because outside is all strange for you Mm -hmm. That's very true. Yeah, and then house is not chill for you, then you have nothing to chill with. Also, we are thinking for babies and long term to live some somewhere. And if he, she struggles with this, better to move earlier to some specific place, feel comfortable for her. And as I've, well. I've tried so hard to assimilate to this area. Mm. Like I found a Pilates studio. Um, we found like good restaurants, and I've just I've tried so so hard to put my roots down here and for Jin it's worked out really well which is what makes it makes me sad because Jin's really settled into living here and he's really settled into having his life here whereas me on the other hand I feel like my life had gone from being settled to upside down mm. like it feels like I'm in a constant state of chaos trying to make myself fit into this space when actually I shouldn't have to do that I shouldn't have to force myself to be comfortable in a house that I'm actually not comfortable in. Also, the reason why I was hesitating for moving was because number one, I was also settled here. But thing is, I was comparing the value for spending money for moving is actually not 
that cheap so i was thinking oh is it gonna work this whole changing and hetty was upset for more than 10 times and i couldn't how can i say, rely on this house my own you know what i mean yeah we so Jin was like let's give it a few more months let's see if we settle in why don't you see if changing the location of some of the furniture is gonna help um why don't you see if it's just a time thing and the longer we were here the worse it's gotten for hetty's for me for hetty's feelings and for me i think it's also the personality for me i can sleep everywhere oh i mean i need the good bed but except that i can sleep or can stay everywhere but hetty needs some specific style she needs and we're finding we we want to live somewhere like long term like a long term with the baby as well and to be honest for the seeing the baby yeah i agree we can't have a baby here because outside of this house it's all the roads and it's not a, like a town it's, it's because more like because we're in a villa we're right next to the streets that have all the restaurants on which when we first moved here we were like this is going to be fantastic we're going to eat out every night this is going to be great but in reality what it is is lots of drunk people lots of rubbish lots of cigarettes on the floor and not the best place to take snowy on a walk yeah snowy was the biggest problem as well but but also these things are such a blast we have and this is amazing house that's why like also when we just put this house in the statement it didn't take longer we had it, three people who came to see it and all three people were like i want to move here yeah and which it took, took one day to sell yeah. this house this house was bargain with this amazing structure it's beautiful. With, the, with the design and also it's got balcony it's and gone the, upstairs it's got a lovely bathroom it's got fresh tiles yeah. it's just not for us and also the location is in gangnam so everything is perfect but doesn't just fit um us so yeah we're that's why we're moving to the apartment and we're just um, gonna be right next to a stream that has yeah. um, walking trails on it as well next to park as well mm -hmm. it's in a much more residential area mm. it's a much much more quiet area it's slightly away from the station there's more families that live there and yeah. more married couples and it's just a lot more slower pace of life than currently where we are and i couldn't give up the location that's why we're going to gangnam still jin really loves living in gangnam because they have um <laughs> everything these, they have these ping pings ping pings no they have these ping pings which are the electric scooters that you can rent and jin has a little helmet and a proper helmet and he ping pings everywhere <laughs> Because we don't have a car, that's why. We don't need a car. Yeah, because we live in Seoul. But anyway... So Jin Ping Ping. Not Ping Ping, it's Kickboard. Our yeah. new house, that we have already found one. It's absolutely... We already did the house hunting, it guys. Is, it's awesome. So we will do the house tour and the house moving vlog again, which was not expected. But we will share the vlog and the moving vlog again for you guys. But we're and so lucky because we yeah. have everything. We have all the furniture. We have everything we need. We just need to... To pack it up and take it to the new place there is a kitchen there is an oven there is a dishwasher there are two bathrooms <laughs> not one but two the point is that we want to find a place live long time and want to have a and baby right now oh. we don't oh not yet right now we don't feel i want it hetty doesn't want it but still we want to feel settled and right now it's me that doesn't feel settled it's totally fine that's why we're sharing our story to our people as well because we want to talk about this and open about what you feel and how what you struggle you know i just want to be like when you know that a space doesn't fit you and the space isn't working out you think you're going crazy but actually it's okay to not feel comfortable in a certain place and it's even more okay to change your mind about something just because you've picked something doesn't mean that you have to stick with it if it's not working out and you've tried other options we tried everything else we could have thought of before we decided okay we we're gonna try and move yeah we changed we tried really oh. hard but yeah it's got three rooms <laughs> did you hear that are you excited anyway guys thank you for watching and always thankful for everything just everything and just just we love you guys we love you so much yeah and we're so grateful to have a community with all of you guys yeah we just want to be open and honest with you guys and yeah. keep you updated in our life journey 여러분 항상 봐주셔서 감사합니다 감사합니다 네. 사랑해요 사랑해요 즐거운 추석 되시고요 안녕